A man was found with his throat slashed in Rocky Point, Clarendon on Saturday. According to reports, police were alerted to the scene after residents reportedly heard a loud commotion at the Bobloo Vibes Bar at about 11.50 p.m. A man who has been identified as Aubrey Robertson was later observed near the entrance of the establishment with his throat slashed. The man's grey Toyota car was parked a few meters from the scene. Saturday's incident is the first homicide recorded for the parish since the start of the year. Five persons, including three juveniles and a female, are now in the custody of the Old Arbor Police in St. Catherine, after three guns were found in a car in which they were traveling. According to Senior Superintendent Christopher Phillips, head of the St. Catherine South Police Division, Sometime after 3 a.m. on Sunday, explosions were heard in the Old Arbor Bay area. In response, the police mounted a roadblock on the Old Arbor Bay main road leading to Old Arbor, and the driver of a car with five persons aboard was stopped and the vehicle was searched. Two Taurus pistol and an unknown type of pistol, along with ammunition, were reportedly found. The identity of the persons who are now in custody have not yet been released as investigations into the development are continuing. A Toulon man died from injuries he sustained when the motor car he was driving overturned while he was returning from a grave digging exercise in the parish on Saturday. The deceased has been identified as Andrew Brown of a Trelawney address. The Trelawney police reported that about 6 p.m., Brown was driving a motor car along the Hyde All Main Road when he lost control of the vehicle, which flipped before being flung into a ravine. Brown sustained multiple injuries and was taken to the Falmouth Public General Hospital where he was pronounced dead. The incident came a day after a man was suspected to have died from a hit and run car from a hit and run in the parish.